It is 818 now. Today marks the last edition for now of our Destination Indiana series. We're headed to Park County, known as the Covered Bridge Capital of the World, and Sadie All reports. Through Park County's enchanted rolling hills, you'll find 31 covered bridges still in use after over a century. Somehow it worked out that we saved ours and many other people either destroyed them or they didn't take care of them and, and we've preserved ours so, and we want to keep those 31. <laughs> the county had two main builders in the 1800s. The oldest is at Portland Mills built in 1856 and the longest one is Jackson Covered Bridge. The public's interest in navigating Park County to find the covered bridges was the driving force behind the start of the Covered Bridge Festival in 1957. Today, the Visitors Bureau helps with that. They have maps, they have tours you can take, the uh, roads are marked with the tours. In some spots, it's almost as if time stands still. Whether it's landmarks or landscapes, Park County Commissioner Jim Meese tells us there's plenty to make a day out of exploring. If you want to do uh, come in and do a, uh, an adventure thing like uh, canoeing or uh, boating, then there are places to do that. Park County is home to Raccoon Lake, Turkey Run, and most of Shades State Parks and the beloved Billy Creek Village, a living history village that typically closes after Labor Day. Meese says the county scenery serves as inspiration to many artists and crafters. You know the people selling those items actually made those items. Couple Austin and Courtney Cook handcraft and glaze clay mugs for their business, Clay Plant Road. Their local artist, uh, Chuck Wagner, he used to throw a lot down at the Billy Creek Village. Um, and I went there as a kid on field trips. It really kind of inspired me. Another trip to Park County could have you locked up for the night. So this building was built in 1879. It is the third jail to the county. Now the cells are rooms to the old jail inn and drunk tank. We had um, the great great granddaughter of uh, who killed Bonnie and Clyde. She came in 2013. A place where there's something to see for all.